Hello comments, this is Shady here, and as you guys can tell by the title, inside today's video, I'm going to be going over my wishes for Spider-Man Far From Home, so let's get right into it. So overall, I'm pretty excited to see this film. I do really like the MCU, and personally, I think the MCU has been at an all-time high with its movies. Captain Marvel really surprised me, and personally, it's one of my favorite MCU films, and definitely one of the most underrated ones, and we also got Endgame, which is one of my favorite films of all time, so I do hope this lives up to the quality of Captain Marvel and Endgame. I also do hope the threat, or inside the film, is relatively grounded, not necessarily an end-of-the-world scenario, and it seems like that's what they're going for. It seems like more recently, villains in the MCU have been great. I do hope Mysterio follows in the footsteps of Thanos and Vulture. This will also be the film to introduce a multiverse inside the MCU, so that means later down the road, there's a possibility we make it a live-action Spider-Verse, which, by the way, I am going to be making a video talking about the possibility of a live-action Spider-Verse movie. That'll be coming out later this week, so stay tuned for that. But back to what I was saying, I thought Endgame did a great job of explaining how exactly the time travel works. If you go back in time and change something that branches off into an alternate reality and doesn't really change your future, even though there are fans of the comics like me who do know what the multiverse is and how exactly it works, I feel like they should explain it so it makes sense for the viewers because if, you know, like average moviegoers, because if they don't know what's going on, it's going to make viewers not really like the film that much though. Overall though guys, I'm really excited to see Spider-Man Far From Home. All of the marketing so far has looked great. I really like Homecoming. It's probably the best Spider-Man movie and right now I'm going to give Spider-Man Far From Home a 7 out of 8. That's the video. Hopefully, guys enjoyed it. Subscribe to Econ Comrade. Drop a like on the video and turn that post notification bell. Go check out my last video. I'll see you guys in my next one. This is Shyson off. Peace out.